Listen, Sarge, we just had an unauthorized core dump into the network. I tried to contain the power surge, but something's escaped. You four computer warriors have been developed by Parallax to seek out and neutralize a group of malfunctioning AI programs who have been transformed into dangerous computer viruses. These viruses have made an unauthorized entry into the bitstream. If left unchecked, these viruses could cause irreparable damage to the entire world computer network. The self-proclaimed leader of these viruses is Megahertz, a dangerous program who will stop at nothing short of complete domination of the bitstream matrix. Index poses a unique threat to security due to his vast knowledge of the network and his limitless memory. Null is a backup utility program who always does what he is told. And with Megahertz giving the orders, there's no telling what damage he might do. Minus is an AI program completely devoid of logic. There are no limits to this virus's search for power. He will let no obstacle stand in his way. In selecting you four warriors, Parallax has forged a team with strengths and abilities necessary for the successful completion of this mission. Rom, you will serve as team leader. The responsibility of finding and neutralizing the viruses rests with you. Grid, you are the diagnostics program. It's up to you to keep the computer warriors functioning at peak performance. Micron, you will provide statistical analysis of the mission, keeping constant contact with the vast data banks found throughout the network. And Scanner, your built-in programming will enable you to follow the trail of the viruses no matter how faint. Our most recent plotting has placed the viruses at this exact location in the bitstream. Locate the most direct route back to Parallax! Scanning all available pathways. Scan the pathways. Scan the pathways. I don't need a mega brain to know the shortest path to Parallax is a straight line! <laughs> <laughs> Any virus that fires this blaster without my permission will be neutralized by me faster than a Wozniak! Understood? Huh? <laughs> Huh? Computer warriors! Evasive maneuvers now! They're splitting up. I'll take the lone target. The rest of you go after the remaining viruses. Mathematically, with five tunnels and three viruses, there are 720 possible pursuit scenarios. Scanning. Their trail leads. This way. What makes him so sure? Circuitry. Scanner, your circuits better be right about this. indicates we are in a telecom port. Telecom port? What does that mean? It means they're trapped. Megahertz, I have determined we've entered a telecom port. So? It means the bitstream ends today. Then we go beyond the bitstream. Beyond the bitstream. Beyond the bitstream. One last shot before I go. <laughs> Megahertz, dead end, dead ahead. Dead ahead, dead ahead. Go through the portal, we'll be neutralized. Surrender viruses before it's too late. Never! <laughs> They're gone! Computer warriors to parallax. Virus neutralized. 
Returning to Central Core. Update. Uh, uh, condition functional. Uh, correction. B -b 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 partially functional. This is not the bit stream. Uh, megahertz experiencing b -b 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 minor disorientation. Minus status functional. Index, your uh, opponent is merely an inanimate object. No threat, no threat. Opponent is an inanimate object, inanimate object. What? Oh. Huh? <laughs> What's that smell? I can't believe it. <laughs> My computer's on fire. <laughs> Must have let it over. Heat. <coughs> oh, man. How am I going to finish my homework? <coughs> what Why I you are you on a small <coughs> disk drive? Time to check the manual. Nothing in here about smoking disk drives. Better call Leon, Ace Computer Jockey. If that nerd can't fix it, nobody can. You're right, Megahertz. This is not the bitstream. It's a world populated by giant, hostile carbon units. I understand your sensors are state-of-the-art scanner, but no known program could have survived an energy surge of that magnitude. Precisely my point. These viruses are unknowns. Parallax considers them neutralized, therefore they're neutralized. Have you tapped into a data bank that can explain our present situation? Scanning. Wait, I think I've got something. The power surge which freed us from Parallax also gave us the ability to transport ourselves between the cybernetic matrix of the bitstream. How do we get back into the bitstream? In theory, we should be able to be reabsorbed into the bitstream through this portal following a simple reformatting procedure. Brilliant as usual, Index. Only you forgot one minor fact. This portal is damaged. Well, then, I guess we'll just have to wait until the, uh, giant carbon unit is able to repair it. And in the meantime, we're marooned in a world populated by hostiles. Ah, uh, then I suggest we find appropriate hiding places until the portal is repaired. You seem to have all the answers, Index. Where would you suggest we hide? Unauthorized tap into one of Parallax's data banks indicates that the viruses have not been neutralized, but are in fact functioning outside the bitstream. Confirmed. Computer warrior returning to telecom portal. Scanner, wait! I will repair the portal for your arrival and update your system software to enable you to make the transdimensional fold. Your primary mission? Seek out and neutralize these viruses. But once outside the bitstream, you must keep your presence undetected. Parallax hasn't repaired the portal. This will be a very short trip. I've lost Comlink with Parallax. Huh? Where are we? The Gaian dimension, also known as Earth. Certainly is a very odd-looking geological landscape. Remember our mission. Search for viruses. So far, no viruses. Only strange-looking artifacts. No sign of virus here. Negative viral infestation here. Keep searching. They must be here. Somewhere. <laughs> Man! 
Omega Hurt! Yellow Alert! Roger. Prepare to be neutralized! Why, you took the words right out of my mouth! <laughs> Neutralizers have no effect on matter originated in this dimension. In that case, I suggest a tactical retreat. Possible escape route sighted. <laughs> on second thought, we must exit through this open passageway, no matter the danger. But our directive, we must keep our presence secret. We won't have a presence if we don't get out of here soon. Follow me! Reformat to circuit speeders and pursue the computer warriors! Index, which way did they go? Scanning. I suggest we make a systematic search of this entire artificially constructed environment. But we'll be staying together, right? I wouldn't want to run into any of those hostile carbon units without backup. Know what I mean? In our current situation, we are open to attack by both the viruses and the hostile native population. The viruses have shown us the solution to our immediate problem. Camouflage shells? From our recent skirmish, it's apparent that virtually any object can huh? be converted. Huh? Well, what are we waiting for? <laughs> Scan carefully. Probabilities indicate they must be in this chamber. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Should not all time display units maintain synchronous? We've no time for your feeble-minded speculations! Stay in formation! People might have speculation. Uh, computer warrior at uh, 12 o'clock. Uh, 3 o'clock. Uh, uh, fire. Ambush. Uh, uh, back. Cease fire. We're just wasting neutrons. Surrender, Megahertz. The game is up. Brave words, computer warrior. But you must know that Megahertz only plays by his own rules. One of the viruses is broken formation. Copy, Rob. I've got him. What's the matter? Afraid of the dark The device they've entered has a primitive electrical servo system. I can see it on my scope. Think we can flesh them out? No! Let's go wrap things up. Oh, oh no! Micron! <laughs> Tough break, warrior, but I have a feeling that this will hurt you more than it does me. Exactly what I had in mind, but so much for the foolhardy computer warriors. On to our next conquest, Parallax. Mm. Mm. Ah, status update, guys. All circuits are in order, but my circuit speed is a bit tangled up at the moment. Ah, disoriented, but functional. Well then, get oriented. The viruses are headed for the portal. Oh, <laughs> 
clear. Bitstream formation! Nothing can stop us now! <laughs> All clear. Grid, where are you? The viruses must not get through! Just follow the leader. Here's a little gift from Parallax. <laughs> Virus is captured and transferred to disk. By all indications, I'd say mission accomplished. Quick, hi! Today's turned out to be a total washout. But at least Leon said I could come over and use his computer. Hey, what's this digital clock doing in my room? Where did these come from? This is too much. I'm better off at Leon's. At least he's got a laser printer. That carbon unit just walked off with our prisoners. We have lost unless we can locate this, this Leon. I think we're in luck. While I was in the carbon unit CPU, I noticed an electronic mail address for one Leon Parker. And traveling at the speed of light, I'm sure, will beat that carbon unit to his destination. Computer warriors, more men for bitstream re-entry. Evil viruses are attacking the world's computers, and the computer warriors have been generated to stop them. A cyber trophy changes into an evil techno tank, forcing the computer warriors down. Hiding in a Pepsi can, the computer warriors fight back and deliver a direct hit. But the viruses keep coming, so the computer warriors convert a flashlight into a rocket blaster and wipe out the virus air attack. Computer Warriors, expect the unexpected. Eat sold separately. Computer and pencil sharpener available for 1990. Only from Mattel.